Hey everyone! In this video I want to show you how I implement Utopia Design Principle in my Web Studio project. Also, I have one good news, so... Utopia is not a product, a plugin or a framework. It's a way of thinking about fluid responsive design. To start you just need to define type scales for a small screen and define type scales for a large screen. Tell the browser to interpolate between the two scales based on the current viewport width. To define types, I use Utopia Fluid Calculator on the website and I'm starting to change in the default minimum and maximum viewports because I'm using a little bit different sizes based on my design. But I, and I used uh, the default font size is 16 pixels for both screens. Then I change in type scale and here we can use we can see how our fonts will change from the mobile and to the desktop screen it's a little bit preview and here utopia generates the code i want to change prefix it and copy just variables not the all code but on the variables then i go to the global root and create new token uh, in this case all these fluids variables uh, will work on the all pages on my website. Nothing changes because I already have Utopia responsive tokens, but I show you as an example. Now I can use these variables in my styles. I put fluid font 5 for this heading on the base viewport canvas and it works responsibly on all other screens. In this demo, I created these uh, hover labels to show current font size token of each of the text blocks to show how it looks like on the mobile and desktop at the same time. I really like how it looks like on my old iPhone 7 Plus. Also, on the Utopia showcase page, you can see how other designers uh, make Utopia live on their designs. For example, this website, if we open DevTools, we can find this h1 tag and here we can see how it computed between mobile and desktop if we push the screen we can see how font size variables are changing from 72 pixels to small here in the project i save the link for the utopia calculator configuration if you open it you will see the current setup of this project all numbers all variables except the prefix name, so keep in mind. And here is my another client's project where I have used Utopia Design Principles. I used it for all font sizes, starting from the base font size to headings. And by touching only the base canvas viewport, it updates sizes from large to small accurately. Link to this demo project I leave in the description of this video and if you would like to support me and my channel you can find link in the footer of the project. Also I have a good news, I make all my WebStudio templates free for all. Links to copy to your WebStudio account you can find on my website. Soon I'll add them to the WebStudio library. So hope this video was helpful for you, see you in the next episode and keep learning!